Welcome back. It is time to bring in Lex to our contact center. Rather than getting customers to press their keypad, we will integrate Lex to route them based on their intents. To do this, let's navigate to our AWS console and search for Amazon Lex. On the Lex page, we can create on create bot. I will build a traditional bot. We'll call a bot the Lungo bot, and we'll use the basic Lex permissions. Is use of your bot subject to Children Online Privacy Protection Act? No. I will pick next. Our language is English, and the voice we want to use is. Let's test Gregory. Hello, my name is Gregory. Let me know how I can assist you. I think I prefer Matthew. Hello, my name is Matthew. Let me know how I can assist you. All right, we'll go with Matthew. And click done. Next, we create intents. Intents represent what our customers might be interested in doing in our contact center, like placing an order. So we create an intent for orders. Let's save this. And then we create another intent. Let's create an empty intent for complaints. Let's save this. So let's create another intent for inquiry. And save. The next step is to configure utterances for our intents. Utterances are what our customers might say to trigger their intents. So this is what the bot will be listening for from our customers to determine what their intentions are. For others, for instance, if a customer comes into a contact center looking to place an order, the customer might say things like, I want to place an order. We add the utterance. You might say something like, other jackets buy jackets oh I want to buy a jacket save this for complaints a customer might say I'm experiencing a problem I have an issue product return
maybe wrong size. Wrong item. These are all transits. Let's save this. And for inquiry, a customer might say something like store location. Or store hours something like when do you close or say store hours so let's say this intent as well so we have created three intents and we have created utterances for the intents so let's build a bot Okay, our bot is successfully built in English. We can go ahead and test. So, if a customer says something like order oh, jacket, we see that the intent orders, the order's intent is fulfilled. Let's say, can I buy Oh. open to buy or let's say something like jacket um Or if a wrong size of jacket, wrong jacket size was delivered to a customer, the complaint intent was fulfilled. So now let's add this bot to our contact center. To do that, we search for Amazon Connect on the console. We'll click on our instance and then we go on to flows here we have amazon lex and we created in, in the us east region if we search for our bots here we have the longer bot we select it and we choose the alias and add the bot to use the bot in our flow, let's go back to our flow. And we want to replace the DTMF with Amazon Lex. So if we come in here, and rather than use DTMF, we'll use Amazon Lex. Select the bot. I'll use the Lungo bot. alias the test bot alias next i'll add the intent add an intent we have three intents orders we have four inquiry and we have four complaints. Let's save. So next, we connect outputs to the right queue, and complaints goes to the right queue. Let's save. publish so before we go on to tests 
we need to change the interaction on the get customer input. So we'll change the text to be spoken here to something like this. You're not talking to a bot. My name is Matthew. What can I help you with? You can say something like orders, inquiries, or issues. So now we save. Right. So let's save and publish. Now let's go on to test our new flow. Once again, I'll go on to the control panel. And I'm available. And I'll dial in. Welcome to Rose's store. To direct you to the right agent, please listen carefully to the following options. You are now talking to a bot. My name is Matthew. What can I help you with? You can say something like orders, inquiry, or issues. Orders. Thank you for calling. Your call is very important to us and will be answered in the order it was received. So. We can see that this time around the customers don't have to punch in the letters on their keypad to get routed to their queues. They simply uh, tell the bots what their intent is and they get routed to their respective queues. We can still improve on this design where customers interact less with agents. Join me in the next video where we will leverage on the chat functionality of Lex to improve customer experience in our contact center.